the prayer of a righteous man prevails. You're watching Faith Time with Yamkela Joseph, a servant of God in our time. Connect in faith. Jesus Reigns TV, impacting, dominating, colonizing nations with the gospel of Jesus Christ. We bless the name of the Lord, what a marvelous time, what a marvelous our family. God is about to do great things in your life. Now I want you to pray for the nation of Congo. The Spirit of the Lord made it clear and clear to me that the nation of Congo is under a cage. There's a spirit that is binding that nation so the administration that is in the nation of Congo cannot move forward and cannot serve to the interest of the people of Congo. Now the Lord has spoken to me that there are some interested parties in that nation to cause stability and to take the nation back to the state where it was before. But I hear the Lord say to me that I have anointed the current president of Congo with my spirit to become the stumbling block to what those who want to shake that nation, to what those who want to destroy that nation. There's an anointing that upon this president and the Lord said that in his presidency, Congo will begin to thrive and there shall become peace and there shall become restoration of what has been stolen in that nation of Congo. So right now I want you to pray for Congo because the Lord said to me that there's going to become some attempts of some others to try to destabilize that nation and don't and not allow the government system to do what it ought to do so that it can serve the people of Congo. But they want it to do what it want, the what they want it to do, and of which that is actually against the nation of Congo and itself. These are forces of darkness from outside of Congo, trying to dictate to the Congolese and to the people of Congo what should be done in their nation and what should come out and come in. Now the Lord is saying to me that the president is the enemy of these people who are surrounded the political arena in Congo. So right now I want you to pray for the president of Congo so that God may give him the upper hand. As the Lord said to me that I have anointed this president to break the yoke of darkness and to make sure that those who are trying to pull that nation down won't be able to stand. Because in his reign, the Lord said that I shall make sure that Congo is restored back to the presence of the Lord once again. I want you to pray for the nation of Congo as you pray for the nation uh, of the world. Make sure that you're praying for Congo as well and pray for your own nation. The Lord is about to do greater things and the Lord is about to change your life. May the Lord bless you. This is Jesus Reign. Make sure you subscribe. Until I see you next time. Shalom. Thank you for watching Jesus Reigns TV. I hope you are blessed by the teachings and the prophecies that you keep getting into this ministry. The Lord is about to change the entire world. Now I want to take this time as you have heard the word of God to lead you into Jesus. If you've never accepted Jesus Christ in your life, the Bible says you cannot see the kingdom of God. So the only way to have it is Jesus. So if you don't know Jesus Christ and you say, Man of God, I want you to lead them. I want you to lead me into this Jesus that we are talking about. So I want you to make this prayer after me. So Lord Jesus, come unto my heart. Cleanse me. Purify me. So I believe that you are my Lord and my personal Savior. Lord Jesus, you died and you rose from the dead. And today, because of your blood, I am cleansed in Jesus' name. Lord Jesus, take away every sin in my heart. Wash away all sin and make me a new creation. And thank you, Jesus. So immediately you made that prayer, family. Now you are a child of the Lord. You are welcome as a new believer. Make sure that you go read and study the word of God. Look for other people who believe in Jesus like you. Share the word of God together, fellowship with them. And make sure that you build your salvation again. So right now,
I want to say, may the Lord bless you, may the Lord make His face shine upon your life. Continue to watch Jesus Wayne's TV, continue to click that subscribe button, and continue to share with the good news with your family and friends. May the Lord bless you. Until I see you next time.